Wake up! All right, I have like a zillion things going through my head right now, and how do I summarize it? Well, first of all, hey there, everyone. This is Yoga. I'm playing Out of Wild, more specifically the DLC Stranger. Whoa. Um. <laughs> so, okay. So last time I, after finding the place looking pretty isolated, I realized that this is because like everyone's like hanging out at a house singing songs together, and you know what? That's pretty cool. And then one of them broke all my bones, which is pretty cool. <laughs> so I've been wondering. Well, okay. More importantly, more, more rather, so I had a thought while I was editing the video together yesterday and I alluded to that in the video description. So assuming that the people in that, assuming I want to go in that house and that the people in that house will be hostile to me whether or not I am being rendered, consider the fact that all the access ports, well, most of the access ports have a big ol', you know, just have all the mummified remains of a bunch of owl people in it, right? And, um, but you see, like, the flame on their thing is still there and burning and whatnot, right? What happens to them when the dam breaks? And the room gets flooded. And their flame gets doused. Like, for real though, like, what does happen to them? You got these fine fall people sitting in that room, enjoying their afterlife, quote unquote, their post-life retirement. Hang out with the guys in a dark valley. Do they just die for real and like what does that mean because like when when my flame gets doused when the main flame gets doused even i should say um i just wake up i wake back up startled go like wah you know and uh it's a pretty good time so what happens with them do they return to their mummified remains and then die for real? Because that kind of sucks for them, but I mean, like, can I make this move from here? So, I've been wondering then, if my goal is to get in that house, What happens to their owl net projection if they die? Do they remain or will they dissipate? Is that the trick? Is what I want to do, in fact, access that house? Where am I? I think I got myself lost a little bit. I'm at the tower, right? All right, not really what I wanted to do, but I'm going to be able to do things here. So is the fact, so like, do I want to do basically is to access that house post dam by getting there from another port? Now, I think that to be able to access there from the docks, I think I need, I would need to go there ahead of time and like open the door I can blow out. But here there's a brand- I've never went in this port before, so it looks like that's what we're doing today. It's kind of accidental. I just kind of went here almost like by automatism. <laughs> that's fine. Today is gonna be a grand old day of victories and knowledge. So yeah, big ringing machine. That exists strictly to press the wrong button to um, remind me of Jim. Also, to wake me up. Alright, here we go. Woke up. So. Well, there's like a glare on something that's really bright. Um, so. What am I... Yeah, so. That place down below, the first church, brings us to a nice little lake, and there's the house, and 
the fun time community house where everyone's having fun singing. The ravine how the ravine port brings us to a massive mansion. And the tower brings me here. So I can clearly see the water. Do I just do I do the thing? Just so I can actually see stuff? It's tempting. <laughs> just so I can see the shape of things. See, like there, there's a hand gesture thing. There's stuff there. I mean, I can barely see anything, though, still. But, you know what I can do? I think that means I can bring this here and then back off. I, uh, I was wondering what would happen if I, like, accidentally dropped it in the water, but I knew what would happen. It would uh, get extinguished, and I would wake up. So, we got this little cliffside gazebo. Oh. Oh, I haven't seen the Beemos alarm, um, digitally. Is that what they look like, I wonder? Maybe. Alright, so what are we doing here? Alright, time to look around. Is that a door? Well, I'm not going to be able to interact with it this way. Oh wow, you can even see like elevators. Yeah, okay, so here's the thing. As fun as it is to be able to see, I think that being able to interact is probably more important. But important note, there's also here, there's a cave. So there's a two-way split right at the start and that's gonna lead to stuff, all right. No, yeah, um, losing out on the ability to manipulate the universe is just too big of a loss. So that's a tower. That's the... Yeah, it's like a replica of the tower. It's a big old tower. Yeah, it did that. I wonder if it also has a secret passage, but I can't go in the water, sadly. But I mean, kind of goes down low. Yeah, I don't know, like this little platform there. And that seems like the kind of platform that like you blow on a candle and that makes a platform. I don't know. Um, even post flood, this will remain intact mostly. So I got the full 22 men. Well, mine is the time it took me to get here. So I'm just kind of wildly blowing my thing everywhere. And I don't know how comfortable it is to watch. So yeah, there's stuff there, but this door is in the way. Oh. Well, there you go. That's how doors work. <laughs> I mean, the fact that it plainly told me extinguish there kind of told me, hey, press a button. And then I created a house. Or something very similar to a house. Do I just double back and explore that right now? So you, this door. See, I think that this is them anticipating the whole... Leave your thing strat. <laughs> and honestly, sure, I get that. Do I have access to uh, like, that side house? It's how I like to explore. Like, I don't want to go in too deep. I want to explore, like, here and keep it fairly compartmentalized. Just so I remember what I've tried or not. There's even plants that gets brought in. They got, like, these flowers everywhere. I mean, that does look like the lower floor of, uh, of a tower, doesn't it? Here you get, like, a chair or something? I don't know, lots of spikes. All these boxes. Just not unpacking their stuff for thousands of years. Oh! And here, I would have a really quick boat ride. 
so good to know so yeah had i went to my first port and set it up because yeah i'm i am absolutely certain that you need to go there early and blow out the door so like there's a dock and then there's a door you need to blow out and i think that if i try to go there that would block me so something to try in the future so there's stairs yeah this is like identical to the lower floor in the material tower very exciting i think you may disagree that's okay i won't hate you it's that same paint it's a different painting instead of yeah see the painting in the real the material tower depicts a tower in Alnet, and this one depicts it inside the stranger. I will be able to blow on these candles though, and maybe they'll do something. And also there's a guitar, but I want to just look here first. Go on the ceiling, do some ceiling activities, uh, or sky activities it looks like. Yeah, check it out, I'm on a roof! Yeah, same exact design. This is an exact replica. But there isn't like the electricity or energy or signal or whatever it was that's going along these wires. All right. All right, let's bring this room to darkness. Whew. Whew. Yeah. I'm gonna keep having my lamp, so. Huh. Hmm. Do you think you need to extinguish it here and then go in the real tower? That's not impossible. Oh, I thought I was locked in. I, I misread that wall panel. Do you think I need to go back? I mean, it's not going to be hard to go back. Just jump in the water and I am at a tower. Alright, I extinguished all the candles. Goodbye! <gasps> yeah. Whoa, alright. Well, um... It's that time of year. That's fine. That is super okay. I'm not really affected here. I say, until I like jump in the water while the deluge is happening and like break all my bones. Maybe I should wait for the... Yeah, for this to happen. I know it's safe here, so... It's so quick, right? Like it's a fl flash flood. It's super quick. Alright. Where's the cave? Will I be able to identify the cave? Man, I cannot... Oh, there it is. Alright, I could identify the KO, I just couldn't see it. Go. Go. Where's my... Where's my ramp? Alright, here we are. So. I mean, I'm not sure why the candles would interact with those lamps now that I think about it out loud. Or, like, think about what it is that I'm doing exactly, but... I mean, he showed the room, he left for a while, then I saw all the lamps shut down one after the other. There was a lamp that was closed in that room, and there was a candle that was shut off. And also, it totally worked. And here we go, yeah, another secret passage! This is gonna be another port? I have... No clue. Is 
So we got ourselves a nice little burner. Is that a window? <gasps> oh, it's that panel. Okay. It's ship log updated, so it should be in my ship log. Oh, waning Saturn, waning star, star. Oh. Yeah. Um. Okay, this was a tease, right? They're like, there's all the seal symbols. There's all the password. They were all burnt. Oh, shoot. Yeah, this is the... What I think is the pilot room, but honestly, I don't know what that symbol is. And that's the password I remember. Yeah, it was sun, I fire, I fire. So. <sighs> waning moon, Saturn, waning moon, star, star. Do I have time to go there? Maybe? No, not once everything is destroyed. Okay. Um... What do I do then? I think what I do is I return to explore during the time I can a bit more in the Tower Owl Net. And. Uh, 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 well, you know what? I landed perfectly fine. Oh boy. Okay. So. Okay. So. Winning Moon. Saturn, winning moon, star, star. Will I remember this? I don't know. That one's kind of com. It's not complicated. Why do I say it's complicated when it super is not? I I'm allowed to think what's complicated, what I want. All right. Okay. Hearing what sounds like the er the rumble before the end song, but it's way too early. I think it's just ambience. Okay, so, and, so my friend who sent me that memory-based message, I think what I'm going to be doing is freeing that individual. I don't know why he was held captive, but he was, or he is, and uh, I'm going to have a chance to save him. But what does that mean, you know? Like, oh, you can... Oh. Then you can close the door again behind you. Such a simple... I mean, yeah, it would be a simple system, assuming you can just do that with, like, your mind. Ooh, an elevator. An elevator that would lead down to where there's that pit, though, right? That I saw clearly in front of my eyeballs right here. Big old pit. And I think that there's a beam most. It looked like it when I was looking um, uh, through a digital verse. I have no context for where I, where I am. There's wild animals. Like, I clearly heard some kind of bird. Yeah, so that's the alarm. Does it know I'm here if I'm being non unrendered? Let's find out. Uh, I'm gonna face it this way so I can see where I'm going. Let's, let's learn about alarms. It does no. Oh, yeah, it is. I can't hear it. <laughs> okay, so it knows I'm here. This is not a proper disguise. Ooh, yeah, and it, it's angry at me. Um, so going back and just concealing my light, then like that—that's gonna be meaningless, right? I should try. I—I I still need to try it. Yep. Yep. Not here. Oh. oh. Hmm. Oh. Okay. So it has more difficulty spotting me. But eventually it will. Yeah. Interesting.
I had a thought. I don't know if I have time to test it. All right. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill myself here. It's not really killing me. Yeah. So this is what happens, right? When the trigger gets alarmed, it goes weep weep. Oh, my tower is falling. Oh shoot! Can I not use this anymore? No! I have science to conduct. You can't do this to me. God dang it! I was just wondering if you die, like if instead of going to sleep, if you die, do one, do you get transported? Like I'm asking this because you know I'm surrounded by dead people in that room, right? And it's implied that they're living it up in Alnet, right? So if I die, do I get transported to Alnet? And if I am dead, can I be woken up? Or is the fact that my ears physically are unable to hear anything, does that matter? Am I willing to stake a whole loop testing that out? But then I got a password I need to put in the in the official film burning building. And then there's I think yeah, I saw a way to get on the boot boat loop from the tower so that I could in theory go to the opera house post flood there and see if that clears up if that's somewhere I want to go. Oh, I got, I, got, I got a lot of breadcrumbs. Oh, I got a lot of bread to eat. I got a full loaf. <laughs> Who wants some loaf? <laughs> All right, Ash and Twin. I'm ready. I, want, I feel like I'm almost going to have to pick what I want to do out of a hat or something. There we go. I, when you see the spot disappear.